This relaxation is called the healing pool. Over the years, it has become one of my most requested relaxations, so I'm sharing it with you now. You can use the healing pool before bed to help you have a deep, restful and restorative sleep, or you can use it in the middle of the day for a break from reality to recharge your batteries and equip you to take on the rest of the day with more energy and more vigour. Its applications are endless and I hope that you enjoy it. I want you to sit comfortably and prepare your body and your mind for a period of healing relaxation. It is easy to do this, simply adjust how you're seated or maybe how you're lying to ensure that you're as comfortable as you can possibly be. The one adjustment that I do want you to make to your breathing now, along with taking generally deeper breaths, is to simply ensure that the outward phase of your breathing is longer, slower and more controlled than the inward phase. This has been shown simply to increase the speed and depth of relaxation that people achieve when they breathe like this. So keeping on with the deep breathing, the long inward breath and the even longer outward breath will mean that your body and your mind immediately start to relax and to slow down. As soon as you introduce more oxygen into the human body, it is noticed by the brain and the nervous system. Signals are sent to show that it is the time to relax. Signals are sent to bring the message of healing and balance to every part of the body. That is the case even if you take three or four deep breaths at any time of day or night, your body will take that opportunity to start to heal and to balance. The amazing thing about the human body is that it has all that it needs to heal and all that it needs to balance and ultimately to optimize its functioning. The problem we have is that we simply don't allow our bodies the time and space to do this healing and relaxing. Sometimes we don't provide the right nutrients, which ultimately are plenty of water and a healthy, balanced diet. When we do that, and then we slow down and breathe, it opens up the doors to healing and to balancing. And as this meditation progresses, I will be making sure your body achieves the optimal healing state. I will be making sure that your body knows it has all the ingredients it needs to optimize, to heal and to balance itself thoroughly. As we move further into this relaxation, it will be helpful for you to imagine yourself somewhere in the world where you relax more than anywhere else. And it would be helpful if that place was outdoors somewhere in nature. I want you to picture yourself in this place, wherever it may be for you. Maybe a place of great natural beauty or maybe a place of simplicity. The landscape that you paint in your mind is entirely up to you. As you picture yourself in this place, all I want you to do is continue to focus on your deep, slow breathing cycles. Breathing in deeply, 
and then breathing slowly and steadily outwards. Something that you can introduce to help your relaxation further is that on those outward breaths, if you simply attach to them something you want to release, now that could be physical tension from any part of your body, or it could be mental tension, some thoughts or emotions that you would just like to release right now. I'm not suggesting that they will be gone forever when you breathe them away during this relaxation, but right now you don't need them because now is the time to clear your mind and allow your body to focus on relaxing, on balancing and on healing. So as that process now continues and as your outward breaths now carry more weight in your relaxation. They carry more importance as they are forming part of your release of tension and anything else that you want to remove from your body. And as I've already said, your body just needs an open door to relaxing and to balancing and to healing and it will walk right through. You don't need to force your body to heal or to balance or to restore itself, it will do it automatically if you give it the space and the time that it needs. Interestingly, it is not only the body that spontaneously heals when given the opportunity, it is also the mind. The mind and the body are intrinsically linked, one cannot heal and balance without also affecting the other. And so now your mind too will start to clear, to slow down and to focus on its own healing, balancing, organizing of information and doing anything else that it needs to, to optimize its functioning. So now as you relax in this wonderful environment that you have created for yourself, aware of the fact that your body is healing and balancing all the time, I want you to imagine that almost out of nowhere there appears a wonderfully beautiful body of water. And this amount of water appears and it can be a pool of man-made qualities, or it could be the most beautiful and wonderful natural pool that simply emerges into vision. Because we have the luxury of residing in your imagination now, I want you to give the water in this pool healing properties. I want you to make the water in this pool the most powerful healing water that exists anywhere in the universe. I want you to give the water in this pool the power to balance and to restore and to heal anyone or anything at any time. I want you to make the water in this pool the perfect temperature for you. Maybe a little warm, but not too warm so that it just deeply soothes whoever gets into that water. As you construct this wonderfully beautiful and inviting healing pool, you feel yourself being drawn quite naturally towards it. And you gently rise up from wherever you are settled and move towards the wonderful healing pool. As you approach the pool, you sense the magical nature of this water. You can almost see and feel a glow of colour or energy. And as you get closer, you can almost feel yourself healing faster already. Because let's not forget, simply by breathing, relaxing, and giving your body and mind some time and space, you are already healing at a far faster rate 
than you normally would when at rest. So now enhanced by the healing pool, you will find that your body is healing and balancing at a far more significant rate still. You now find yourself compelled to get into those healing waters. But there is no rush, and as you step into the edge of the water gently, you feel an immediate sense of relief around your feet and your toes. And the warmth of the water actually shoots up your legs into the rest of your body, warming you up, soothing you from the inside out. And it feels wonderful. As you feel that healing effect taking control of your body, healing and balancing at a far greater rate, you are compelled to continue into the pool slowly and safely and calmly. As you move into the pool and the water reaches around your knees, you feel that deeply powerful warming and soothing sensation in your lower legs. And of course, it is still being carried upwards in your legs into the rest of your body from the parts of you in contact with that water. And you slowly and steadily make your way all the way into the pool until the water is around your waist. Now the water in the pool does not get any deeper than this. This is the perfect depth. The warmth is radiating through your entire body from your lower body, filling your core, traveling through your arms and up into your mind, filling you with a deeply cleansing and healing glow. And as you continue to breathe deeply throughout all of this process, as you continue to relax and balance, know that your immune system too is working at a far greater and more effective rate than it normally would. This healing relaxation will genuinely leave you with a stronger, calmer, more optimized body and mind. In order to take full advantage of these wonderful healing waters, you feel completely safe and completely calm as you decide to gently lie back in those waters. And because these are your healing waters, you have of course given them the properties of flotation too. So you can lie back safely, calmly, fully supported by the wonderful, warm and powerful healing waters. As you do that, you feel a sense of release as the weight is taken from your legs and transferred into the pool. You are entirely weightless. You are entirely calm and at peace. And just as the outward breaths you were taking earlier carried with them any tension or stress or worry from your mind and body, the healing waters of the pool now carry everything away from you that you do not require, want or need. And every moment you spend in these healing waters heals your body and mind further. And I want you to now spend a few moments there. My voice will cease for a short while. There will be nothing but the gentle background music the steady rise and fall of your breath and the wonderful action of your body healing and balancing. Now, after the time you've spent in the healing waters, you will feel deeply relaxed deeply calm and a deep sense of peace permeating throughout your entire body. And the time has now come for you to exit the pool and you will do so gently and slowly 
in exactly the same way as you entered. And the healing processes that have kick-started now and been accelerated by this healing water will continue for the rest of the day. And in fact, beyond that too, the effect of a deeply restorative healing meditation can last days or even weeks. As you slowly regain your feet in the pool, you notice the wonderful property of the water also includes that you become comfortable and dry instantly. There is no discomfort at all as you slowly move out of the pool, the water getting gradually shallower and your body instantly drying as you are removed from it and as you get to the edge and take that first gentle step out of those waters you have taken with you the warm glow inside your body and mind and perhaps the colour or the energy that those healing properties have in your own mind. I want you to carry on breathing deeply as you slowly move away from the pool and as you move further away your body still healing and balancing at a wonderfully fast rate. You have two choices. It is entirely up to you whether you decide to find somewhere comfortable in this place in the world where you relax more than anywhere else and to sit down or lie down and allow yourself to drift into a deep restorative sleep where you can remain for as long as your body and mind wish to. Generally you will rest for as long as you need to. If you are doing this meditation in the evening, you may well find that if you choose this option you fall asleep and stay asleep for the rest of the night, waking in the morning refreshed, restored, rejuvenated and feeling incredible. But your second choice is, if you want to finish the meditation now and re-enter the real world for the rest of the day, feeling refreshed, calmer, rejuvenated and energised, then you can do that. Simply focus on your breathing and bring your breathing rate back to your normal resting rate. Maybe counting your breaths from 10 down to 1 and as you reach 1 you open your eyes and re-enter the world feeling refreshed and calmed and rejuvenated and energised. The choice of what to do is entirely yours. To drift deeper into a state of deep restorative sleep or to count your breaths from 10 down to one and on one to come back into the world and have the rest of your day with more energy, clarity, calmness and vigour. But whatever you choose, you're going to do that now as my voice will cease and the music will gently fade into nothing. <laughs>